If I was the CEO of Winscribe instead of Yeager, what would I change? The first thing that I would do would be to shut down the paid model. Um, I would just make every account free and everyone who uses Winscribe would also be helping mine cryptocurrency uh, for the Winscribe Foundation. Now I wouldn't bother mining anything but Bitcoin because as you all know, Bitcoin is the number one currency and it's more valuable than USD. You could get I don't know, something like $13,000 for one Bitcoin, so why bother charging customers USD when you can just make more Bitcoin? Simple as that. The second thing I would do would be to partner with Microsoft to become the official VPN for Minecraft. The two audiences, both Minecraft and Winscribe, both have a, pretty much the same market demographic. Most people who use Winscribe are little kids, and most people who play Minecraft are little kids. In my opinion, that's a match made in heaven. The third thing that I would do would be to spend more money on advertising. Now you might be thinking this means buying out affiliate websites, or sponsoring YouTube videos, or even making TV commercials like some other VPNs out there. No, instead I would advise Winscribe to instead buy advertisements on blimps or airplanes. Take advantage of the wind in Scribe and we can make Winscribe be everywhere in the sky. Just imagine how cool if you saw a blimp flying by and it said Winscribe on it. You'd be like, wow, that's a VPN I want to use, right? The fourth thing I would do would be to change the CEO's name uh, to Igor instead of Igor. So if I was the CEO, he would be second in command. My second in command would therefore be called Igor. The fifth thing that I would do would be to sell Winscribe and instead focus more on smashing consoles. Now I was talking to Igor and he even showed me some of his old YouTube channel where he was actually quite good at smashing consoles. So I would sell Winscribe, then rehire Yegor, and we would start our own smashing consoles business in 2019. Now some of these videos have a lot of views, viral sensations, and if you can smash consoles this good, why not continue to do it in the present day and age? Google Stadia? Smash it. PS5? The next Xbox? Smash it. The next Nintendo? The next Nintendo? Switch Lite? Smash it! Now these videos might get demonetized, but if they were popular enough, you could uh, make affiliations with uh, VPNs, and that way we don't even have to design VPN itself. We could just be affiliates and make videos smashing consoles. People would love it. The sixth thing I would do would be to hire Tom Spark um, as a brand ambassador. So if I was the CEO, that would be like hiring myself a second time, which I think would be a good idea. If I were to hire Tom Spark, then I would rename Winscribe to Sparkscribe. I think this is a little bit catchier of a name than Winscribe even, because you could have abbreviations as SS, and it could be like two little snakes. Uh, even, even go so far as to change the brand from like a blue into green, and we could be kind of snaky, uh, you know, maybe even that someday called ourselves Snake Scribe. I like it. The last thing we could do, guys, is finally move Winscribe's offices into bunkers. Um, that way everything is underground, secure, all the servers are secure, all the people are secure, everything is secured by DIRT. Alright guys, what do you think would improve Winscribe? Let me know down in the comments down below, and thanks again for watching this fun video, and I'll see you again very soon. <laughs> <laughs>